What's good, Black Star Podcast? Welcome back to the This is your boy, Jared. And um, I got a question for you guys. What is it with these blonde wigs? Mm. You know what? I'm going to just let y'all see this hot mess. And uh, y'all, y'all tell me what y'all think. Because this is ridiculous. Here we go. Hi, Kendra. Hey, boo. What, what I said? It's the whole family. Yeah. <laughs> she said the whole family. family this, this my director. This my director at Illinois Media School. I, she want me in. I need you. To, I was on. I'm gonna come back with my update, but I need you to get her in. Okay. So you doing it for your your, your teacher? Yes, my director. We go to Illinois Media School. Tony, go okay. my teacher right now. All right. So do you guys, where where are you located? Downtown Chicago. Oh. Okay, all right, so put the camera on her face so I can see her full face. All right, there we go. Okay, I can see your full face. All right, what's your name, baby? Hey, I'm Carly. Carly, and where are you calling me from, Carly? Chicago. Chicago. How old are you, Carly? I am 47. 47. What you do for a living? So I'm the director of admissions at Illinois Media School, and I'm also Boss Lady Plus 2. I do radio, TV, and podcast. Okay, you are. I'm here with it. Okay. So you're director of administrations at, at Illinois Media School. And then you also do a podcast and radio too, correct? Correct. Okay. Okay, media girl. What's the zodiac yeah. side, Carly? I'm a Scorpio. Scorpio, you have any children? I have two, and my youngest is 17. And he's gonna go up, he's gonna be gone from the house. So I need a man. <laughs> um, okay, how old are both of your kids? 26 and 17. 26, 17. Both, both by the same man? No. No. Have you ever been married? Never. Never. Okay. So we got Carly, Chicago, 47, Scorpio, director of media at Illinois Media School. Also does podcasts and TV. Mom to two, 26, 17, never married. What kind of man are you looking for, Carly girl? Girl, I'm looking for a spiritual man and a man that's willing to be coachable. Okay. If you're willing to be coachable, then we can talk. Okay. Because I'm a coach. You want to coach? Somebody need to coach this woman to take that damn wig off her head. You looking like a ghetto bar? Let me stop. Man. I mean, I'm just saying I've been single for seven years. I found myself, so I need to make sure that he found himself. So let's let's talk about it. In what ways do you want to coach this man, Carly? In, in in business, like I want to create businesses. I want to create a corporation, a nonprofit. So that's the direction that I'm going in. He gonna, she gonna coach him to leave her ass. That's what she's gonna coach him to do. That sounds like a business partner. That's what I want. You want a business partner Oof. that also you have sex with and is your man. <laughs> so first I want, first I want to be able to trust him. So I want a best friend. Okay. Secondly, I want a business partner. And thirdly, I want a husband. That In that order. Okay, she got a baby. You want a man to wake up next to you. Yo, ugly mother. Good God. Somebody help him. I want to trust you. Business partner. And then you want to be your husband. There you go. What are your deal breakers? Um, Not being spiritual or having a spiritual connection. Okay. Not have a spiritual connection. Um, does he have to? That's it. Um, and we got to be equally yoked. Like he got to make as much money as I make. How much money he got to make, Carly? Close to a hundred grand. Ooh, yeah. I'm just saying this. We got to be equally yoked. I bring a lot to the table. I make money in a lot of different ways. I'm sorry to keep interrupting, but this woman think a, a man that's making a hundred thousand dollars wants to be coached. By a broad in a wig, a blonde wig that don't match nothing to say, nothing on her daggone head. Looking like this. So you want to, so what man is going to want to be coached by the clown? And me, are we serious here? I, this is, I'm on an episode of Punked, apparently, because this is just, this is just too daggone crazy. I'm on the episode of Punk. You literally look like this. And you talking about you want to coach somebody? 
Ma'am, somebody need to be coaching you and what to do. In seven years, you found yourself. Where? Under the bridge? In troll market? What? Where? Good God. This is this. This is this is this is this is, this is crazy. This is insane. I can't be the only one that's saying this. I can't be. This is just. Mm, I can't be. My businesses, we gotta, we we gotta come with the same things. Okay, so have you ever been in a relationship with a man that makes a hundred k? Never been in a relationship with him, but been in a relationship with guys under what I make, and it didn't work. Okay. Okay. So now let's just speak about this in a logical, not saying this what happened. But okay, you're saying you never dated a guy, exclusive relationship that made 100K. If that guy doesn't want to date you back, do you just never want to date again? No, I'm, I'm looking for a, a business partner, like I said, and for someone to be in, a, I'm about to be an empty nester. So I want to no, see that, but I want to just have this logical conversation. So you're telling me you've never dated this man that you just described. So if this man never comes to want to date you back, are you saying you'll have nothing? No, I'm not saying that i'm saying that i'm i'm willing but i want that i want that to be the case but i'm willing to work with someone you are willing, okay so okay because you said he has to be equally yoked financially which was 100k yeah so would you date a man that made less than 100k somewhere between 80 and 100k okay but again <laughs> are these men trying to date you though carly this is what i'm trying to ask you because i don't want you to sit and wait for this guy, what if he doesn't come and try to date you? Then what do you do? Then I just gotta stay single. I don't know. I don't know what to do at that point. I mean, I can't. I can't. I know that I'm gonna have to build somebody. I know that I'm gonna have to get through some other things to get. Well, to you that also person. said you wanted to coach someone, so this is why for me it's kind of confusing because you said you want a man that you have to coach. So that to me, I thought maybe you would be open-minded to a man that potentially. Didn't make as much. I know this is a big thing in, in my black woman community, the mildly estimate. But the question I have to just ask is, what if that man doesn't want you back? Then what happens? So again, I, I could take the, the little bit less in the salary and be willing to be coached. If you gentlemen, let's let's do a raise of hands. Comment down below. Because I know there's gonna be something that's gonna comment. And the question is this. Who wants to be coached by this woman? Who wants to be coached by this woman if you're making $100,000 a year? Who wants to be coached by this woman? Somebody, somebody down below, comment. I do. We do. Just, just, just I want to see a show of hands. Because apparently she wants a man that's coachable, but she wants a man that's making a hundred thousand dollars a year. Am I missing something here or am I or am I am I missing something here? You want a co you want a man to coach him to make a hundred thousand dollars a year or more. You're only making a hundred thousand dollars a year. But yeah, you don't want a man that's making under hundred. <sighs> yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay. Cool. You willing to be coached up? Then we can work with something. Okay. You gotta be coached up. Okay. So eighty k is what, what 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 you would. 80K. 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 I'm sorry, 60K. <laughs> sorry, 60K. Carla can't do shit with you, okay? She can't do shit with you if you got 60K. 80K, if she can boss you up to 100K. Okay, does he have to look a certain way? Um, Not not really at this point. I'm not looking for looks. I'm looking for substance. Okay. Um, Do we got to make a certain amount of money? I mean, we talked about that like the... Oh, yeah, we I'll be, I'll got that. You're right. We went there early. Now it's time for the Kendra cam. The, okay, the Kendra cam is when you stand up and we see your full body. Can you see me? Okay. Let me see this outfit, girl. Oh, 
sure you get to the shoe too, okay? Because that's a short booty, a Ralph Lauren booty, okay? Brain boot. <laughs> <laughs> Don't play with Chicago. With Don't it, play. Don't play. At this point, I'm going to just be quiet for the rest of the video. This, this is just. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna just, yeah, I'm gonna just let this finish. She said, make sure you get the boots. Okay. <laughs> make sure you get the boots. All right, Carly, when was the last relationship? Seven years. Seven years. Seven years ago. Why do you think you've been single for seven years? Just trying to build myself, don't want to be broken, don't want to go into another relationship with a whole bunch of baggage. I'm building my brand, Boss Lady Plus Two. I'm trying to get to TV. Oh. And so I've just been building my brand and focus on me. Okay. Um, you don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask. Does, um, when was the last time you was intimate with someone? Maybe like a little bit under two months. Under two months. Okay. okay. A little bit under two months. Is that guy an option? I thought, but I don't think. <laughs> you don't think that? <laughs> what are three flaws you have to work on, Carly? Three things I have have to work on yes um bending being able to bend because i'm i'm so i know what i don't want to accept right now so being able to bend mm -hmm. a, a little bit um secondly i need to work on my mouth because i'll probably say something that you know when you make me mad it's come out so fast so i'm working on calming down and thinking it's counting to 10 before i respond <laughs> and then the third thing um maybe just work on a little bit more i approach men i need to maybe let men approach me okay and you approach men let men approach you and you said now you do want to you want a guy you could trust a business partner than your husband so you want to be a wife yes what, what qualities do you think make you a wife uh, um intelligent i can communicate um i'm willing like i'm willing to compromise and like, I, I, I do a lot. I own a lot. So I bring a lot to the table. She owns a lot. She brings a lot to the table. Okay, let's do it. We got Carly, Chicago, 47, Scorpio, director at Illinois Media School, also has a podcast. Um, her ambitions is television. Mom of two, 26 and 17. Oh, could the guy have kids? Not little kids. Not little no kids. little kids. If, if they under 10, mm-mm. So no kids under 10. All right, boo, let's do it. How can the guy reach out to you, baby? Uh, um, they can find me at Facebook, Carly, Boss Lady Rainy, or you can find me on Instagram, Boss Lady Carly, um, and then Boss Lady Plus Two. So just search my name. And there you have Yeah, I don't even have to, I don't even have to say what I'm going to say. People in the comments are already going to say what they're going to say. She found herself while she was single. She needs to work on herself because she's approaching men. She wants a man that's making $100,000 a year, but it's coachable. She wants to coach you to make more than $100,000 a year. and She's never been over $100,000 a year. Guys in their 40s, 50s, and 60s. That's all you, bro. That, that's all y'all. That is all y'all. That hot mess in that wig is all y'all. I ain't even gonna say nothing. Y'all y'all not getting me kicked off YouTube. This is embarrassing. This is insane, 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 insane. And I can't say nothing about it. Y'all, y'all... <laughs> <laughs> That's all y'all. Y'all y'all can have that. No, this don't make no daggone sense. This horse puckery don't make no sense. I I I am embarrassed for y'all. Anyways, like your subscribe channel, support the podcast, support the I'll see you guys on the flip side. I'm going to bed. Bye guys.